Yo, yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to my channel, Ace Vendetta with Smell Better Fragrance. I'm your host, Ace Benz. Over here, we talk about fragrances and all things to improve your lifestyle. Today, I want to talk to you about two new additions to my collection. The two that I have for you today, it comes with high level designer brands. And we're going to break it down to see what it has to offer. So let's get to it. Let's get it. Let's go. Before I get to it, you know I gotta give you my public service announcement. I wanna thank you all for being here with me today and always remember to follow your plan. Be better, think better, feel better, on top of all that, smell better. And yo, if you find this content interesting, please like, comment, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell so every time I drop a new video, you'll be notified. So the description I have for both of these fragrances start out with the same exact verbiage word for word but anyway i'm not gonna knock them because of the words they chose because so far every fragrance i've chosen or that i've tried from paris corner have been hits and they've done very well and so i'm not disappointed in the brand but again like i said for the verbiage it's kind of lazy and i'm gonna talk about it right now i'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you exactly what it says word for word paris corner a mere frenetic delicious or Paris Corner, a mere frenetic home intense, is a luxurious and sensual fragrance that is evocative of iconic fragrances of the past. The codes of masculine elegance have been shaken. You can reveal yourself according to your character and sensibility, dressing and grooming to reveal who you really are. Okay. Yeah. All right. So the first fragrance I want to talk to you about is, like I say, from the Paris Corner brand, from the Amir line, it's called Frenetic Delicious EDP Concentration. I found this on Amazon for about 40 bucks, and it's a clone of Christian Dior's Thief Delicious, which was a $330 fragrance based on Dior's website. I don't have a bottle of that, I've never smelled a bottle. I've never smelled it. I would never own a bottle of it. Um, not for $330, you know? I mean, it doesn't get that much hype for me to go out there and, and spend that type of cash on it. But um, again, this is an ADML presentation. Very nice bottle. Fits very well in the hand. It's heavy. Has a magnetic cap. I, would, I wouldn't recommend picking it up by the cap because it's, it, it's not a strong magnet at all. I'm gonna get a spray for you up in the air. It's a wide miss, not the best sprayer, but let's see what I get. So yeah, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna try it on skin. I'm getting cherries. I'm getting cherries out of this. The cherry is very similar to the Galan Long Ideal Extreme or one of those. I got a couple of them. I can't remember exactly which one. But yeah, I'm, I'm getting that cherry. And um, I'm also getting like a, a minty chocolate vibe from it. Similar, similar to that to the mints that you get from Olive Garden, you know, the little mints they give you at the end of your meal. That's what that's what I'm getting from it, you know? Um, it's, it's a unisex fragrance, so men and women can both rock this, and it's warm and it's sweet and it, it projects softly, you know? Um, I think you'll get about one or two feet worth of projection in the first few hours and then after that it kind of sits closer to your skin so it's kind of it will be kind of warm and inviting and um nice date night scent you know it, it, women women love that mint from from out of garden so they're probably gonna love this if you have it all and um again it's not like it, it's not gonna get you noticed but it will get you discovered 
So anyone in the vicinity or close to you, they're gonna smell you and, and they're gonna appreciate the smell. They're gonna enjoy it. Again, this is frenetic, delicious. In real life, by Paris Corner. Now the notes on um, frenetic, delicious is lavender, mint, bergamot, that mint, that chocolate mint. That's what I was talking about, that chocolate mint. But um, the middle notes is sour cherry, jasmine, freesia, tucker bean, vanilla, chocolate, caramel, praline, benzoin, milk, and sandalwood. A little bit of leather, a little bit of cedar. You know, this is a vanilla fragrance with the additions of tucker bean. And it smells like a mixture of caramel and, and almonds. Something in it that smells like a little bit of hay. And it's milky, milky sweet. Uh, but it's, it smells so good. I can pick up the tonka bean, the vanilla. <laughs> Yo, I believe those two right there make it, make it kind of warm and sensual and comforting. It's a very good fragrance, my final thoughts. Very good fragrance, and it's worth buying, especially if you can find it under $40. I suggest you give this a try. Frenetic, delicious, and then real line, Paris Corner. All right, so again, the, the next fragrance I have for you is from the Paris Corner in real line. It's called Frenetic Home Intense. And I found this on Amazon for about $40 as well. And this here, if you can't tell by the name, it is a clone of Christian Dior Home Intense. Christian Dior Home Intense, you can find it on gray markets from like 90 to 120 bucks, you know. Um, this is the same bottle presentation that's the last fragrance, the Frenetic Delicious, except for this label is black compared to the white label of the other. Again, it's a nice bottle, heavy, wheat magnet. I don't know if I showed you, but it got the Pierce Corner name on the atomizer. Little synthetic, but it's got that waxy type of vibe, that waxy smell to it. it it's Dior Home Intense inspired, for real. But um, we're gonna go with the notes, top notes of lavender, middle notes, iris, pear, and musk. I'm not really getting the pear. The sweetness is not coming off to me, but um, the iris and the cedar is there. Picking up a little bit of the vetiver. You know, it, it smells good. It smells good. I don't get the sweetness, but it smells good and it's very similar to Dear Home Intense. This is, um, again, a woody fragrance. It's floral, it's musky, um, and the opening is very aromatic. I mean, I did get a little sting. I think it went straight up my nose, but after that first, first spray, you know, I get this creamy lavender, um, maybe a slight bit of sweetness. This fragrance still has that waxy, lip sticky, and iris type of vibe, just like Dior. It's powdery, and it's, a, again, like I said, it's a bit more synthetic, but um, <sighs> of course, it's not gonna be Dior Room Intense. It's not gonna be that, but you can immediately tell the difference, however, it's the same scent profile. And I did wear it a few times. And the dry down, the dry down is the same. It's very similar, more than the opener. So the Dior pushes, it pushes off your skin a lot more. Of course, it's, it's higher quality. But this version, it, like I said, it's the same scent profile. It's just a little bit lighter. The scent is a tad bit weaker. But if you, if you go straight up, Assassin on the trigger. Then the projection and longevity may increase. It may get you closer to that Dior Home Intense 
profile or, or, or performance. You know, testing both of this on skin, I feel like the Dior lasted maybe two hours longer. Um, again, this one is so cheap. You can just take it with you to refresh. Freneticone Intense is very decent quality and it's classic representation of an iris note, which obviously it makes this fragrance shine. And this EDP is sensual, it's comforting, yet mysterious and dark. And at the same time, when it dries down, it blooms like a flower. The iris comes out that makes the fragrance shine. Final thoughts on this fragrance, it's decent. It's decent fragrance. If you love DHI, that same profile, this is one worth having. I mean, again, like I said, you can take it with you and you can refresh or you can overspray. You're not gonna offend nobody because people love this scent profile and they're gonna enjoy it. So again, for under $40, give it a try. Frenetic Home Intense, Paris Corner. Honestly, I haven't missed with Paris Corner. Honestly, I have not. All right, that's about it for me, guys. Let me know, do you have either of these two fragrances? If not, I suggest you give them a try. Yo, good energy, positive vibes, safe lives. Remember, follow the plan. Be better, think better, feel better, smell better. With that being said, let me get up out of here. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, comment. Let me know your thoughts. Let me know what you're wearing. I thank you for watching. I'm Ace Spence, aka Ace Spendetta with Smell Better Fragrance. Until next time, smell good, smell better, and we'll see you in the next video. Peace. Cause I'm on top of the bug. I'm on top of the bug. Yeah.